Hey guys, and welcome to another video of my 3D drawings. So this is going to be part 2. If you want to see part 1, just head over to my YouTube channel. These are all of my draw 2 horror drawings. Yeah, so if you want to see part 1, take a look. So let's get to it. So here is Pennywise from Stephen King series It. So yeah, he was quite hard to do. The hardest bit was the fist, but also the talons and dinosaur like all of the wrinkles. So yeah, you want to draw this? Check out Draw It Two. And if you want to draw Pennywise from the series It, definitely recommend this. This is Pennywise from Stephen King's film It. So yeah, this was hard to do again with the lightning bolt like eyebrow thingies, orange hair. But also I found the roof quite hard to do, I'm trying to make it look three dimensional and realistic. I'm not putting too many crosses in, but not to put in too little. So yeah, it turned out really well. Here is a like the null from the conjuring. So face swap obviously the hardest bit. Those tiny little starry eyes. Mouth creepy. He's like a nun, yeah. From the conjuring. Yes, yeah, so you want to draw this, head over to Dread 2. I definitely recommend it if you want to draw the nun. So here is Jeff the Killer, a very creepy to draw. Really, the face wasn't too hard. Just a manner of drawing some really creepy eyes and skeleton-like teeth. What I found most um, hard to do was the hair and the hoodie. The hoodie had to get all the wrinkles in and the blood in the wrappers and you wanted to get the hair all nice so it looked creepy like a killer so yeah really good way to draw it and I definitely recommend it if you want to draw Jeff the Killer here's Boogie the Puppet from Saw yes obviously the dummy's face was the hardest bit to do because of those dark eyes and swirly cheeks the big chin very scary. But also the waistcoat and jacket and stuff. The little tie was hard. Because you want to make it look perfect. Like if you look there and it just looks like a nice man. And there you see a scary dummy's face. So yeah, if you want to draw this, definitely recommend it. Go check out Direct 2. It's direct. It is the jigsaw killer from Saw again. There's his pig head. And I find this really creepy because the pig head with the hair just doesn't look natural. It looks really creepy. So yeah, and the wrinkles and the, the uniform. As you can see, I've cut some of these bits in. And yeah, there we go. Big knife there. There's all of his jacket. Very creepy. So yeah, what I found most hard to draw was obviously the pig, the pig face and the hair. So yeah, on to the next drawing. There is the Terminator's exoskeleton in all its glory. I really like the face and the teeth because there's a tooth. It looks like he's been in a fight and it's been bruised and battered. So, yeah. It was really hard to draw this because you want to go into the right proportion. If you do it too big, then you haven't got enough space to do the detail. But if you do it too small, then all that just looks weird because you won't have enough space to do the detail. So, yeah. Quite hard to do. Check out Direct 2 to draw this. I definitely recommend it. And so the next drawing. Here's Arnold Schwarzenegger. 
as a determinator. I actually had to do this quite a few times to get it right because of that eye there and all of the robotic face. But not just that, getting the body in the right proportion. Not getting it to look too small, but not getting it to look like a giant's body. So yeah. The face was tricky. The robot side of the face, the robot side of the hair with all the, the ripped flesh. There's the jacket with all the creases, the knife stubs, the bullets, pockets and everything. So yeah, it was really hard to do. I had to, I had to actually do it a few times. So uh, yeah, it turned out really well in the end. Thank you guys for watching this. Make sure to subscribe to my TG Drawings and like it, share it. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye now.